Hey, this is Keith Everett, freedomwithkeith.com. And in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to make an ebook. And um, this is going to be probably 10, 15 minutes training. So you will be able to produce an ebook like you see on the screen right now um, in, in a few minutes of training. So let's go back to square one. First of all, this is the ebook, this is the final product, okay? And you can see it's got text, it's got pictures, and it's only five page, six pages long. Because when you're doing an ebook for the purposes of offering it as a lead magnet, it doesn't need to be a great long book. You don't need to be writing, you know, a novel. You just want to write something that's quick and can be consumed in about five minutes. You also want to create a title that is attractive and you want to get a good ebook cover done for you if you can't do them yourself. Now, here's what I do. I go to Fiverr. So let me just see. Hang on. Let's get Fiverr up. Fiverr.com. F-I-V-E-R-R.com. And I've been using this person here to do my ebook covers for a long time. Um, she is very, very good. And um, you can just contact me if you want to know who she is. But I can tell you she is Christy1603, if that helps. And this is the cover that she produced for me for about $5, which is £3.83. And it comes in two parts. This is the insert, and this is the actual cover itself. So it's the cover plus the insert. Now, once you've received this, you download it onto your desktop. And what I would suggest you do is create a file for everything that's going to go into your ebook. So, in other words, think of, you know, plan the ebook out first, think of what you're going to put in it, think of the pictures you're going to put in it and put that in one file so you don't have to keep searching all over the place for the components of the ebook. Now, to, to construct the ebook, it's real simple. All we're going to do is we're going to come on to Google Docs, grab an account, it's free, and you see this is where the ebook began its life, right? So if I click on it on here in Google Docs, this is the actual ebook when I first started creating it. And again, it's real simple. It's only got a few pictures. Uh, I'm going to put a picture of myself when I'm signing off there. But what it what is important here is that you give them some value. And this ebook is going to help them make a decision about joining your business. Because what you see here is an ebook called The Science of Making $175 a Day Online. Now, this is about what people can actually do to earn this kind of figure, right? So I know full well that in my company that I work with that this is possible. So I created this ebook about how they can actually do that. And I've given them my story. So you start off with an income disclaimer. Now, prior to your income disclaimer, you're going to import one of those covers, right? The insert cover, and I'll show you how to do that in a minute. Then you've got the earnings disclaimer, because obviously when you are talking about earnings, you want to make sure that you're covering yourself. So I have that disclaimer here. Now, again, you can either freeze freeze the, um, you know, your, 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 um, your video, so you can screen capture this. Or you can just ask me and I will give you the details of this, right? But what I've done is I've opened it up with a welcome. Then I've put, you know, hey, I am Keith Everett, clickable link, right? First clickable link. So if you're not sure how to do clickable links, real simple. Just put the text you want to click and then highlight it, come up to this chain. And that goes through to my blog. So you just put your blog in there or whatever address you want to put in there with a HTTP, etc. So that's your first link. 
and then I've imported an image, another image. I'm talking about finding a product to promote. So here I have actually put the company. So you can see it's an affiliate link, right? Now remember how I told you how to do this. You just highlight it, come up here to the link, put in the um, address, and you now have a clickable link. Now I know some of you know how to do this, but a lot of you don't. So I'm just taking this pretty slow, this training. Feel free, feel free to forward it if you want fast forward so okay so that's the basis right now here's how we start to to do this let me just go back to um, Google Docs you're just gonna set out to start a new document so you click here and you get a completely blank document now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just put the actual one on my left screen I'm gonna keep this right screen um, blank so first of all you want to put your title of your work up here right so I'm just going to quickly call this the, um, the science there we go right now the first thing we need to do is import the insert cover remember so here's what we do we just click on insert image you go search for the image or you can just drag it and drop it what I'll do here is I'll search for the image because I've put everything in one folder that says ebook. Right? You can see there are the images, there are the two covers. So I'm going to click on the insert cover, click open, and that should insert that into the document. Now you want to make sure it fits. What I can see here is it's it's hanging over a bit down the bottom. So you can just drag and resize until you until it looks fairly equal. It actually looks fairly equal now. So alright, so once you've inserted that, just click the outside of the image and that will now settle into the page. So there's your first page. So I'm just gonna click on to the next page, page two, and I'm just going to put some text. So I'm actually going to copy this from my document, save me writing it all out again. So I come here, so you would type your text in. I'm just going to copy and paste here. All right, so I've copied and pasted that into page two. So you can see we've only been doing this a couple of minutes and already it's starting to take shape. You want to have some kind of copyright here. You don't want people just thinking they can steal your images or steal, you know, steal your work, okay? So on the next page, it's going to be page three. Again, I'm just going to copy some text. You would type your text. And obviously, when you're putting text in, make sure you're breaking up your paragraphs so you're not you know you don't want to give people huge chunks of text to read those of you that blog you know this anyway but um, and also at the beginning of some of your um, sentences you know where you're you're putting things like this truth factoid number one you know you want to bold that up a little bit just make that look a bit bit better so here we're going to insert an image again so remember how we did this we come up to insert and then we go to image we want to find the image that we're going to insert and the image we're going to put here is this one click open insert your image into your document there's your image now what I would suggest you do is resize your images before you put them into the document you can resize them once they're in but you can see this one fits perfectly the reason it fits perfectly is because it is resized to fit perfectly so that image has just gone straight in there 
So now I'm going to add some text below this. Hope this is useful to you. When you start doing ebooks, you can really take this to the next level because what I'm showing you here is basic stuff. Of course, you can write books. You can do all kinds of stuff, right? You can create products that you can sell. So this is a free uh, ebook that you give away. It's a free report. And um, where are we? Page three. One, two, three. Okay. So I'm going to now take it on to the next page. And again, I'm going to just copy and paste some text. You would actually um, be typing this. So we've got a header here, followed by some text. And then I'm going to break up some of the text with another image. So I'm going to insert an image into here. Remember how we do that? We come up to insert, we go to image, and then choose an image to upload, which is going to be this one. We've inserted that image, and again, that was resized, so it fitted perfectly. Now let's add some more text. Now I'm just copy and pasting. Um, I've put a link in there, remember, because you want to be linking up to your opportunity. And talk about your opportunity in a way where you can explain the benefits here, because that's what you should be talking about. And give the people value as well. In other words, give them information that is useful to them. So they are now taking a completely different opinion of you because they had no idea what you were about in the beginning because they just signed up to your list. But now they are basically finding out more about you. You know, you've got your story here at the beginning. I tell my story when I first came online and how I struggled and basically lots of things I did that didn't work, but what did work. So, you know, this is all true. Just tell people the truth. So I'm going to add some, some more text here. picked up an image of it as well there I shouldn't have done but um, so that's page four and this is page five now let's pretend I didn't pick that up um, all I'm going to do is insert an image real simple come up to image choose an image click on the image and just insert it now what's this taken so far it's just taken about five minutes to put an ebook together if you've got the text ready. So you could have the text in another document, just cut and paste, right? It might take you, uh, you know, another minute or so to put the links in, but you can produce an ebook probably in about five, five minutes, five or six minutes, let's say 10 minutes at the most, okay? So there is your complete ebook. Now, obviously, go through it, check for spelling mistakes. Um, and here's what we're going to do next. We're going to turn this into a PDF, right? PDF is the, is the common file uh, for eBooks. So what you do is you come up to the top left here. Remember, you're in Google Docs. And then it says Download As. So you come over to the right. And you're going to download it as PDF. Now you can see. It's now going to download, and again, download it to your ebook file, the one that you've just created. Click Save, and you now have that downloaded. So the next and last thing is, how the hell do we deliver this to people? Well, there's several ways of doing this, but the way I'm going to show you is the way that I use, which is real simple because you want something simple for people to do, right? So open an account with Dropbox. Now it's free to open an account, but this is a, a way to deliver a file online to anyone 
that has the link. So in other words, what you're going to do is you're going to upload your PDF to Dropbox and then when someone opts into your squeeze page to get the free gift, you're going to deliver the product in the first email. That way, they have to give you a good email address in order to receive it. So when you do your uh, squeeze page, just tell them it's going to be delivered to their email address. That way they'll give you a good email. So here's what we do. Um, I'm just, you know, you're in Dropbox. Let's say you've opened this account up. As I said, it's free. You can see I've already got a copy of it here, right? So that's the actual real copy that I uploaded. So all you would do is, let's say, because this is it down in the bottom left-hand corner. So all you're going to do is just drop the file. And you can see down the bottom here, it's uploading that ebook to Dropbox. Okay, now it's uploaded it, so I'm just going to click on the details. Okay. Now, here's what you do. Over here it says share. This is the link you're going to share when you want people to, to be able to download it. So you just click that, create a link, click on create a link. So anyone with this link can view this files and then copy the link. There's the link. So when you put this link into an email, This is what they click on. This is what they're going to see. And then they come over to the right hand side here. And I think they click there. There you go, download. And they just download it. But what they will see is there'll be a button here that just says download. Okay, it's only because I've actually logged into the account that um, I can't see that button. But they will see it. So they will not only be able to look at it here online, but if they want to download it, there will be a button here. They just click and they can download it to their computer. So that is how you create an ebook in around about 10 minutes. Hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have and you want to know what it is that I do to create ebooks, create videos and all kinds of other stuff online and make money, just click the link above if you're watching this on Facebook. Click the link below if you're watching this on YouTube. And I will see you in the next video. Bye for now.